Did he forget the names just like Steve Harvey? Yo. Tell Adidas that we need a million in production. Yo, y'all. Jimmy McElroy here. Welcome to season one, episode five of Death Note. Last we saw light um, perpetuated, um, instigated, and created a situation on the bus involving a guy who followed him and some criminal who he made into a crazy asshole. All to get the name of the FBI agent that was chasing him. Now he plans on killing him, which I personally believe is an atrociously bad idea. But we'll see what happens. The kid has not been wrong yet. But that way he bad himself. Let's get to it. I didn't think this kind of thing happened here. So you were already riding the bus when the hijacker got on? Yeah. And in the end, the guy freaked out, jumped off the bus, and got hit by a car. Did he die? Yeah, probably. Well, I couldn't really stick around to see what happened to him. You know, hmm? it's a little hard to believe that that was all a coincidence, don't you think? <sighs> what do you mean? You got on that bus because you were investigating someone, right? And now you're telling me that this criminal is most likely dead. Doesn't that suggest that you... That's enough. <laughs> Look, darling, you and I know you used to be one of the best agents in the FBI. Oh, okay. But now you're mining around. I was about to say, how's this a big motherfucker put all that together? Agent. Your mind will be occupied with better things, too. More importantly, tell me how I can convince your dad I'm worthy of his daughter. Kira doesn't scare me half as much as he does. <laughs> oh, let me guess. You're about to write down the name of that agent, aren't you? The one from the bus. Not yet. I'm going to wait one week before writing his name. If he died, God, this is Mr. Ray Penber, turn around and you're dead. I am Kira. That's right. Don't turn around or put your hands in your pockets. I won't hesitate to kill you here. It, it couldn't be. This voice. I've heard it somewhere. That's right. The one sweeping the floor. I'm going to kill him just for you. But, but how? Don't do it. choice but to kill him. I figured if I didn't kill at least one person, you wouldn't believe me. Although that man has been repeatedly charged with sexual assault, he's managed to avoid conviction every time due to lack of evidence. And fuck him. You really thought this through. All right. Now get on the hill and this is like a inner or outer route. It doesn't matter which direction you take. 1970s detective noir. Every way to do talk. Times. I know that voice. Why on earth can't I remember who it belongs to? Fuck. I'm nervous for this guy. I don't know why. Just met him. Who, are you? who are you? signing a death warrant for all of his colleagues. As for Penber's boss, he died of a heart attack after sending all of his agents a file. And the other 11 investigators, they all died of heart attacks after receiving the same file. Holy shit. It's already decided. We're calling off our investigation. I have Chief Yagami on the line. Hell, I just got off the phone with the director of the FBI. According to him, it seems that you arranged for the FBI to come to Japan and investigate everyone here associated with the task force. Yes, I did. Love apples. Damn you, Kira. Wow. 
Honorable of you, Dad. I'm proud to be able to call you my father. And if anything should ever happen to you, I'm going to find Kira and make sure he gets executed. And give me creep just now? Instead of the fucking saddle bag! Because he told us to get down, but I don't really remember any of the other passengers. I see. Well, thanks for talking with me anyway. I appreciate it. Fucking female Sherlock Holmes is gonna be a problem, man. It's a bit of a long shot, but if what I'm thinking is right, Kira could have been one of the passengers on the bus that day. And if that is the case, then I know that he's close enough to use this bus route. Fuck. He's been waiting for this to happen all along. Why would he do something like that? There were a number of people on the task force who distrusted L before this investigation began. And once we got started, we had detectives resigning left and right. Following that, classified information was leaked. So I'm not surprised that he didn't trust us. In other words, he was waiting for the task force to get narrowed. Fuck. Fuck. That was, that was, that was. The best episode so far. Right up there with uh, three. Is that where L debuts? This trick. This is no, this is better than that. This is the best episode so far. Um, <sighs> Kira's plan. Um, I think it would have worked if. So I, I'm not gonna apologize, but I will say I might have been a little bit off because it would have worked if uh, Ray Pember's wife wasn't Batman. You know what I mean? Like it's it's clean. You get rid of all the guys, right? So right, you don't know who the person that was following. It doesn't matter who who got killed. All of them. If you just kill Ray Pember, be like, oh, he was following light. Ah. They're all dead. At his hand, that's so fucked up. Oh man, it was clean. But the wife, I gotta try to remember her name at some point. The wife is clearly smarter than Ray Pember was. Immediately. Because she told that he told that story to her, and it was like, what? Motherfucker, are you retarded? Really? 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 And now she knows, she thinks rather, that it had to be somebody close to that bus route. Shit. Shit. So now the task force is being narrowed, or has narrowed itself down to five, I think at this point, five plus L. I wonder if L is going to be somebody we know. They're building this thing up like, oh, it's this motherfucker, but we haven't met anybody. Oh. I'm definitely going to try to do this two times a week. Maybe even starting next week. Maybe even. Anyway, uh, post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe. Anybody feel bad for Bill Cosby? Did he forget the names just like Steve Harvey? Yo. Tell Adidas that we need a million in production. Yo. I done told y'all all I needed was the infrastructure. Yo. Now we hide us in the streets, it ain't no discussion. James Harden, Swaggy P running up the budget.